Kourtney Kardashian and Justin Bieber bumping nasties more than we think. And Selena Gomez says Disney Channel was just like high school. Oh dear lord, and Beyonce, my god, we love her and this news will make you cry. You guys, it's all going down right now on Holly Scoop's Daily Rewind. <laughs> What's up, you guys? Welcome to Holly Scoop's Daily Rewind. I'm Maddie Conklin. And I'm Madison Hill. You got, you're stuck with the Maddies today. <laughs> but let's start off with Kourtney Kardashian and Justin Bieber. Juicy stuff. We know Juicy they've been stuff. hooking up since, what, 2015, mm -hmm. on and off, you yep. know. He's been screwing around with other girls. She's kind of been back with Scott Disick, but this new news kind of got me like, what? It's crazy, it's crazy. They're hooking up multiple times a week, people. How she finds the time to do that, I don't know. I gotta right. give her props. I mean, I mean she's wow. got three little babies at home. He's just got a world tour he's on. So when they find the time multiple times a week, the crazy thing about this is that they're not going to the Ritz. They're not oh, going no. to motels. No, they're, they're, going not, to, they're not seedy. They're no. not gonna go to motels. No, no, they're no, classy, no. They're, classy celebrities. They're so classy that Justin is loaning a friend's house for their bang bang. Time. Wow. Like, just, just casual going to a mansion to, you know, to do your thing. Like, what? Do your thing and then, you know, and go then, separate ways. Do they clean it afterwards? Oh, like, do they God. have maids come in? Like, Maddie, I'm just. Maddie, they do not clean. Uh, that's true. That's, it's Kourtney Kardashian and Justin no, Bieber. But, like, no. it's crazy that, you know, Justin's like, yo, dog, can we use the house today? Yeah, dude, I'll just loan it to you for a couple hours. <laughs> What's even more crazy is that they're using like fake cars to go to and from, so they're not they're not caught. You gotta be incognito. Yeah, you gotta be incognito. You don't want the paparazzi to know but what's like, going on. Why do they care if they're caught? We already know they've been hooking up. It, it's still a thing. Like, my, why don't you just come out and say, hey, we like to bang. We have really <laughs> great, great chemistry, and this is what we do. Because I don't think they really wanted to go anywhere. I think it's kind of embarrassing to just say like. Oh, it's a friends with benefits situation with this that kid who's a lot younger life, than me. That is real life, people. That I know happens. it's real life, but I'm just saying, you know, whatever. Either way, I think it's kind of shady, and they should just come out straight out of the game, just say like, yeah, Maddie we're friends with benefits. Truth, truth, people. Kind of like how Selena Ooh. came out with a lot of truth, talking about how Disney Disney Channel, excuse me, was a lot like high school. I know, kind of crazy. Which to me, high school was really good. Good to me. Yeah, good memories for me as but well. But for some people, it's the worst experience of their life. They never want to revisit it. And, you know, a lot of people bullying. get bullied. Yeah. And Selena said just that while working for Disney Channel, she was bullied and she was also bullied in elementary school and middle school. So this poor girl, Lord knows, I mean, with all that kind of trauma, like, right. yeah, I'd be going to a therapist and rehab, but. But she's gorgeous who and she's so think? sweet. I just don't understand how anyone could attack Selena. I know. Well, who do you think? at the Disney Channel was like, was it people on Wizards of Waverly Place or was it like the high school musical people? Or the freaking, I don't know what other I shows I think as on, a child like, starts really difficult. I mean, you have a lot of people coming at you, whether it's agents and producers and directors and then people your age. I mean, I can only imagine between all of that, it had to have been tough for her. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, and that kind of leads us to talk about her Instagram and why she keeps deleting it and mm -hmm. kind of, well, deletes it off her phone, not completely. But um, she just said her fans try to cut to her soul and the comments, the negative comments really take a toll on her. Essentially bullying never ends. It doesn't matter if you're a kid bullying or an adult. Sucks. Don't bully people. It's not nice. Yeah. All right, so moving on. Is Miley some Cyrus- Some lighter news. Some lighter kind of gossipy news, of course. <laughs> is Miley Cyrus pregnant? What do you think? I'm thinking yes, because they kind of had that questionable secret wedding here a yes. couple weeks ago. Yeah, but so. would they move that quickly? We don't know that for sure. She's not showing any signs of pregnancy. That's not what we're talking about. We're actually talking about pictures that were taken of her and Liam, Liam. Hemsworth, mm -hmm. their Malibu compound, if you will. Um, no big deal. Looks like they're building what could be a playground and a nursery. So, Ooh. prepping for babies. Do they, are they gonna have babies like, you know, nine months from now? We don't know, but that's really interesting. I guess interesting. we have to wait for that, but <laughs> we still, wait I see. kind of, I kind of hope so. Yeah. I think it would be kind of cute for them to have like the surprise, like, yes, we got married, yes, we're having a baby. I think that would I be mean, exciting. I mean, Dax, uh, Dax Shepard and mm -hmm. Kristen Bell did it. I'm obsessed with them. I know, you, well, you look like her. I, I just think of her every time I see you, but I mean, a little Liam Cyrus, Liam Cyrus, oh. no, a little Miley Lee. Hemsworth. There yes. we go. Like yes. she was a, such a cute little girl. He's so freaking gorgeous. Like they will I make beautiful just... babies, whether it's now or down the road. I think we can all agree that their babies will be gorgeous. Yes, yes. Um, Beyonce. Okay, I will say that I'm. I haven't been part of the Beehive. I. I like Beyonce, but I'm not a diehard fan. Right. But this news really made me go like, 
Dang, Beyonce. Yeah. I effing love you. So she, um, a, a, a cancer patient from her hometown of Houston, Texas, mm -hmm. Ebony Banks, a senior in high school. Um, it's a very her, sad story. It is. Very sad. She's has a very rare form of stage Ugh. four cancer that she is un unfortunately dying of. Mm -hmm. And her last wish was to see meet Beyonce. So what do her and her friends and family do? I love it. Start an online campaign, tweet at her, hashtag it. This is why I love social media. This just shows that social media does have some good qualities there because is, this yes. is incredible. This yeah. is amazing. So Beyonce gets wind of this social media campaign to have Ebony meet Beyonce. What does Beyonce do? Responds in the coolest oh, way possible. FaceTimes her while she's in the hospital. I love that. Yeah, this video is so love cool. That. The girl's like, I love you, Beyonce. Beyonce's like, I love you. And I mean, it isn't the first time she's done it. No, she, no. And I love to see celebrities give back. I mean, this right. is what it's all about. Do. You know, um, when you can use your status to make somebody's day or life in this I situation. Mean, a dream come true. I just, I love it. Yeah. I give Bay so many props. Right. I love and it. I mean, she's kind of having troubles with her pregnancy, but mm -hmm. to like not focus on that and focus on others is just so admirable. Right. And this is why we bow down to Queen Beyonce, yes. you guys. Let us know what you think, <laughs> though, about all this news, Courtney and Justin. Do they just need to come out and say, yeah, we like each other a lot? And Miley Cyrus, is she really pregnant? Or are like people freaking out that construction means she's gonna have a baby? <laughs> and are you a diehard Beyonce fan? And does this news just melt your heart? Yes. Let us know, you guys, in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching Thanks, Holly Scoops Daily Rewind. We will see you here tomorrow. Bye. Bye.